I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a San Francisco cable car. I'm going to take two fingers on the left, put a dot, two fingers on the right, put another dot. Come back to the left and we're just going to draw a slightly wavy line all the way across off the page. Now I come over here on the left and I am going to just put a dot and I come over on the right, I'm going to try and keep it even, put another dot. Come back to the left. I'm going to draw a curved line. Connect on the left. Curve line. Connect on the right. I come inside and I'm going to mimic that line again. Skinny mini. Curve line connect on the left. Curve line connect on the right. Right in the center, I put a baby circle on the left and a baby circle on the right. I come back to the left. Right here on the inside, I'm going to draw a straight line across, connect, and then I'm going to draw it again. Straight line across, connect. I jump over and on the right hand side, I'm going to draw a straight line, straight line down, straight line over, connect. I'm going to jump over to the left and I'm going to draw straight line, straight line down, straight line over, connect. Starting back over here on the left, I'm going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. Right next to that, I'm going to draw straight line over, straight line down, connect and right over here again straight line over straight line down connect right on this right hand side I'm just going to draw a little straight line out straight line down connect I come back over to the left and right on top I'm going to draw little straight line out little straight line up little straight line and leave it floating and come over on the right hand side and we're just going to draw a straight line out straight line down straight line in connect come back to the left I'm going to draw a straight line up straight line over straight line down connect right above that I'm going to draw a skinny rectangle straight line out straight line up straight line over, straight line down, straight line connect and now I'm going to mimic that line one more time. Skinny mini, straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. Okay? Now I come inside this rectangle and I'm going to draw curve line one, curve line two, curve line three, Curve line four, curve line five, curve line six, curve line seven. Okay? Come back inside and we're just going to draw curve line, straight line, connect, curve line, straight line, connect, curve line, straight line, connect, curve line, straight line, connect. 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 Okay. Now come down to the left and we're just going to draw a straight line across. Jump over. Straight line across. Connect. Come inside on the top and we're going to go curve line one. Curve line two, curve line three, jump over, starting on the right, curve line one, curve line two. 
okay? Come down below, and we're going to continue this line up, jump over, straight line down. We're going to come back in, and we're going to draw straight line, jump over, straight line, underneath, straight line, jump over, straight line, okay? Come up, and let's draw a skinny straight line across, connect, and inside, we're going to draw a straight line, curve line, straight line down, connect, straight line, curve line, straight line down, connect, straight line, curve line, straight line down, connect. Jump over to the right hand side. We're going to draw a straight line down, straight line down. We're going to come up here and draw a straight line over. And now we're going to mimic this line. We're going to draw a curve line. Come up, curve line again. Okay. Now, come down to this space. We're going to continue this line. So jump over, straight line, straight line, jump over. Continue this line, straight line. And we can't fit that one in. Okay. Now, this space, watch what we do. We're going to start off with a big straight line, curve line, straight line, connect. We're going to do it again. Big straight line, curve line, straight line, connect. Come down a little further and we're just going to go one, two straight lines, one, two straight lines. And now we're going to mimic, if you've got room, skinny mini on the inside or outside, Curve line, straight line, inside, cur straight line, curve line, jump over, straight line, straight line. Okay, there's a lot of curve line, straight line, B, 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 B. So let's see if I did it correctly. And really, the only way we'll know is when we start coloring. Let's see how we're going to color this. Okay, the first thing I like to do is color in spaces that I know are going to help me see what I'm doing. So these very top row of little curved lines, straight lines, these are all glass windows. So these I'm doing a blue-green. Then I come down, this is glass. So I'm going to color that in blue-green. Blue-green. This way I can kind of see where my lines are. Otherwise there's so much going on on this cable car, it's like, what? So I'm going to do blue-green all the way across. This is all glass windows. Then these are the doors, and these also are glass. So we're going to make these blue. Now you can kind of see what we drew a little bit better. Okay. Next, I know my wheels, the inside part is going to be black. I'm leaving the outside part white. And the little baby circle white. That's an aesthetic decision I made. I think it's so you can see it a little bit better. So that's that. Okay. Then I got out brown because this brown kind of stabilizes everything else. So this is brown, this bottom little skinny rectangle. Jump over. And this section around my doors, this is brown, down the middle, these little crossways, these are all brown, this is brown. Again, so I can kind of see what I'm doing. Okay, now, everything else is going to be red or yellow. So. This part right here I know is yellow, so I'm going to move that across. This part behind my windows is yellow, so I'm going to do that yellow all the way across. And you will do, as always, a way better job than me. I come down and this section is going to be yellow, framing my windows. And this section is yellow and this little band across is yellow 
I'm working my way across my outside of my doors this should be yellow keep going this space should be yellow keep going this part is yellow keep going and this part is yellow and I think I'm missing a line I knew I would I've got to draw a little straight line down little straight line down and how do I know that because this is yellow and I didn't know it but couldn't do it because I didn't have it drawn okay now the rest should be red and I'm not going to do a real good job because it's a lot to color this should be red around my windows this should be red boy I'm really not doing a good job this should all be red hello keep going this should be red I should have used my skinny crayons this should be red and this should be red now these windows these should be red this should be red whoops back to yellow the outside of these windows should be yellow okay I know it's very confusing now this section whoops this should be red this should be red this should be red jump over this should be red this should be red and this should be red okay this is kind of a crazy cable car but I will accept it okay let's see what it looks like all colored in okay this looks a little bit better than the one I just drew but you can still see I need some help with my coloring okay bye bye